Does the frequency distribution appear to have a normal distribution? Explain. So I'm going to go ahead and write down the table over here. So we have our table. The temperature here, the, those are called classes. Those are our classes. Uh, the, cla the first class is the class containing all the temperatures between 40 and 44. The second class is um, the class containing all the temperatures between 45 and 49, etc. Uh, I'm not going to write them down. Instead, I'm just going to write down the frequencies. So 1, 3, 8, 15, 8, 3, 1. So a frequency table or a frequency distribution is said to be normal if the frequency starts small, get big, and then get small again, and if it's roughly balanced on both sides. In other words, you want a, a nice bell shape, right? Um, something like this, a nice little bell shape. So here it's 138, 15, 8, 3, 1. So it's, it's perfect. So 138, 15, 8, 3, 1. So it's 138, 138. It's perfectly symmetric. It's totally bell shaped. So the answer is yes. This is very, very normal. So let's see. It's going to be either A or B. Let's read A. Yes, because the frequencies start low, proceed to one or two high frequencies, then decrease to a low frequency, and the distribution is approximately symmetric. Um, I think it's this one. This one, if you glance at it, at the end it says the distribution is not symmetric, so it's not going to be that one. So it should be A. Let's try it. All right, good stuff. Hope that made sense.